Himo Boys again as gunmen army in every shooting over. Himo Boys again as gunmen army in every shooting over. Reports coming in say gunmen and the military are in a heavy shootout and Ingidi and Akata in Oru West local government area of Imo State. According to Sun News Online, the accident began as early as 6 a.m. today when the Ulums allegedly enforcing the partial lockdown. Order of the indigenous people of Biafra and Ipo barricaded the roads, ordering people to go back to their houses. However, the source said they were later confronted by the military who responded swiftly to counter their order. As at the time of this report, it is not clear if there was any casualty on both sides. City News Nigeria recalls that IPOP yesterday urged people in the southeast to pray fervently for peace in the zone, unconditional release of Namdi Kanu, and restoration of a Biafra nation. Although a statement by the spokesperson of the group, Emma Powerful, did not order a seat at home, but urged the people to lock up their shops temporarily during the duration of the prayers and open shortly after the prayers. A report coming in say gunmen and the military are in a heavy shootout at Nbidi and Akata in Oru West local government area of Imo State. According to Sun News Online, the incident began as early as 6 a.m. today when the Udlums allegedly enforcing the partial lockdown order of the indigenous people of Biafra and Ipo barricaded the roads, ordering people to go back to their houses. However, the source said they were later confronted by the military, who responded swiftly to counter their order. As at the time of this report, it is not clear if there was any casualty on both sides. City News Nigeria recalls that IPOB yesterday urged people in the southeast to pray fervently for peace in the zone, a conditional release of Namdi Kanu and the restoration of a Biafra nation. Although a statement by the spokesperson of the group, Ima Powerful, did not order a seat at home, but urged the people to lock up their shop. Although a statement by the spokesperson of the group, Ima Powerful, did not order a seat at home, but urged the people to lock up to lock up their shops temporarily during the duration of the prayers and open shortly after the prayers details later um now i've come to the end of our today's news and before i go i have a few comments here the first comment here which is written me says please let's let us not fight against ourselves we are one and still suffering the same problem let's come together Put our heads together to see if we can bring solutions to the problem. We are all person. And um, there is another comment here that says, Tell that to the bone to the root tribe that doesn't have leadership qualities. And a very simple division, just Yoruba and Ausa be one, then Igos. Others tribe be one, just simple thing. Another um, comment here which is reaching me says, I'm still asking the question, this question, is it by force to be one Nigeria, why Nigerian government can't allow Biafra to go and form their country? Just simple thing. And um, another comment here says, Himonites, control your tongue. You people are real architects of your own problem. And so stop extending your problem to other Southeast. This is one of the problems we have in this country. While other people keep suffering in their state, some people would still come out to twist their throat to twist their tongue. Obviously, it is very glaring this person is not staying in Imo and he doesn't know what is going on presently in Imo. Well, he got some responses and it's kind of been a um, um, fight. And well, anyway, I have another comment here that says, You Igbo bandits, you, you cannot success, you are just deceiving yourself soon. Nigerian security would. Finish you like Gary with vegetable soup, and um, a comment here too. A lot, a few comments. A, another comment here that says this is getting too much. We aren't making progress by killing each other. Why can't we just dialogue about? This is my question. 
do we think it is these people do we think it is hyper people that are killing people do we think they are the ones killing themselves even though as if it has it is very corny and have the hands of this devilish thing this very very corny corny i don't know how to put it a very corny act maybe they are just playing the stage they are playing a role just to just to start killing so as to change the people of other region thinking maybe it is the ipod people that are that keep that keep um disturbing the state another comment that says shame to nigeria definitely the nigerian armies are no longer valued in west africa not to talk of african as a whole as a whole why they can't fight common civilians not talk of fighting war i do not blame those those are um, militaries that keep killing civilians. They are placed on order. And it is part of the constitution. Army follows orders. Whatever they told them to do, they do it. And why is it that people would look up to are the one killing us? When the killers finish, I pray we won't be a victim. But when the killers finish, who are they going to who are they going to be the leadership? Who are they going to lead? Who will they place their leadership on? And lastly, my comment here says, Emo people should burn down any house belonging to Uzo Dinjo and Co. to feel the pain we are passing through. Emo was a peaceful state before he entered as Supreme Court governor. He finally brought war in our land, but he won't go unpunished. To my dear listeners, this actually is an act of as if it's a political appointment too. When someone is being voted in as um, um, he entered as Supreme Court governor. One, he actually when he's been appointed.